Jubal's Dirty Little Secret. Hello. Hello. Hey, you have a dirty little secret? <laughs> yeah, so basically my dirty little secret was that I was dating somebody that lived in a different city than me, but they lived in a city where I have a cousin that stays there, and basically he went to the bowling alley and told me he was going with some friends and my cousin ended up at the same bowling alley and told me he was with a girl so I drove down there and I was waiting to see if he was going to walk out with her which he did and they ended up going to some kind of bar together or something so I sprayed the front top of his car and his door handles with pepper spray because he has a tendency of like touching his face all the time and I knew if he touched his door handle he would end up seeing his hand was wet and put it to his face to smell it which he did oh gosh I know I know I shouldn't say this out loud yeah, he was like literally screaming in the parking lot that his eyes was burning and boys are never any help because all of his friends was just recording him, laughing at him. <laughs> he was like, oh, I think it's an eyelash in my eye, like something's in there I can't see. And then he started calling me. He started calling me like, I need help. I need your help. And the whole time I'm thinking like, you don't even know. Why your eyes are burning because you got pepper spray in your eyes. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's well, so, yeah. pretty good. Honestly, I love intelligent revenge stories. Yeah. Like, there's something about it, and I shouldn't say that out loud, but this one's funny. <laughs> well, thank you yeah. for telling us your dirty little secret. I'm sure you've inspired a lot more people to have a, a way to get revenge if they get cheated on. <laughs> have a good day. You too. Thank you. Bye. Hello? Hi. Hi. What's up? You have a dirty little secret? I do. Sweet. What is it? Um, I drive a Mercedes E350. Okay. And uh, I do pretty well for myself. And but when when I get low on gas, I'm it's kind of fun. I don't know. We have fun with it. Me and my friend. He was like on the opposite side of town. Me and I, and we would make a bet if I could fill up my gas tank by asking people for money <laughs> or for gas. Asking people for gas. Okay. And not money, but uh, before I get to a place, and ninety nine point nine percent of the time, if I you know I'm just halfway decent, and I'll point to my car and I'll say. I left my wallet at the office, and I don't want to make it back there. I don't have enough gas. Would you mind helping me out? And uh, oh. most of the time, you just fill it up. Really? <laughs> it's awesome. It's awesome. And, awesome. Car, and then, you know, I've laughed my butt off all the way over your house. So, and, yeah. What? What we were, we were going to see if we could do it. We were going to see if we could do it cross country. Okay. Do it across. <laughs> you can make it all the way across the country yeah. by asking people to fill up your like, tank. Over by the, not yeah. paying for gas. Why not? Why not? You should take a picture and of each person. We both very hard, you know, so. <laughs> That's, funny. That's funny. Yeah, I know. Well, That's the rich fine. get richer. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Make exactly. Them suck us. Uh, thanks for telling us your dirty little secret. The best form of revenge. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good one. Thank you. You as well. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. What's your dirty little secret?